Hi, que no que hay. It's me, Angie. ¿Cómo están? Hey, ¿Cómo están? Dime, dime abajo. How are you guys? Let me know down below. Let me know how your week is going. Um, so today's video is going to be a pretty little thing haul. It's just ooh, un chiquito, un chiquito, un chin -chin. a small one. We have the clothes right here, and as you can see, it's all been washed and dried because, you know, with everything going on, we are still in COVID, people. Remember, we are still in COVID. Um, so, yeah, this is the haul. Um, yeah, but before I want to start this video, I want to say that um, I've been feeling lately that, like, I'm not doing my per. I feel like... Like, with everything going on right now, I'm scared to go thrifting. Even with, like, wearing, wearing a mask and everything, keeping social distance and washing everything, I'm so scared. So, obviously, I feel like I'm not doing my part and not buying second hand. Like, literally, this pretty little thing is fast fashion. And when it comes to fast fashion, it's like, online shopping is so quick and easy. But then, for me, it's been hard to, like, return items because... Especially like Pretty Little Thing and Boohoo and all those ones. Pretty Little Things under Boohoo. Which we know Boohoo was under investigation. Came out that they've been using basically slave labor of Im immigrants. And in the UK, I will leave that, that down below. So this was order was made like before, after, before right? Um, yeah. Other than that, uh, yeah. So I will leave everything about all the past passion documentaries and reading down below. Anyway, than that. But during this time, I feel like it's gotten easier, and then it's like, for some reason, my coping mechanism is shopping, <laughs> keeping up food, and I'm someone that, like, someone, I feel like a hypocrite, because I talk about, like, how you shouldn't be buying fast fashion, but here I am buying fast fashion, but I feel like that's something that's, like, and it's, like, it's not only myself, but... I feel like if we all do our part in some little way, we don't have to be perfect. Especially with going on right now, like, you could, and then it's like, you could buy off Thread Up, Poshmark, Macari, Depop. Um, yeah, I, I try to do my part on there, but it's still, like, kind of hard. Um, and then it comes in time where sometimes, like, someone's selling something you see, but then... You see that it's still on the website of that company, and you go just choose to buy it on there because it's cheaper than buying it from another person who's probably selling more. But other than that, I'm digressing, sorry. But yeah, I am um, basically this is my I ain't sh sh haul of being someone who's like, oh, don't buy fast fashion, go secondhand shopping, la 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 la. Uh, yeah, <laughs> and like also when it comes to thrifting, remember to choose pieces that you want, or like you want, like yeah, that you want, and make sure you basically in a way like thrift wisely too because you don't want to be buying so many stuff, and which leads to like, uh, like really high consumerism and shopping. And there's also the part, this part that there's some people. Like, I feel like I can't stand myself, but there's like. So much like in a way like I've seen like even at Goodwill or in some places like the prices are going up because there's people buying that really can afford to not thrift. But I feel like I'm digressing. <laughs> I'm gonna start something, but uh, let's start with this all. <laughs> oh, remember to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel as well as follow. Follow me on all my social media down below. Okay, let's get started. The first item we have is this tie-dye dress. I know tie-dyes everywhere, but I love tie-dye, especially since I grew up in the 2000s. So, yes, this is the dress. It's pretty thick, which I like. And I like it because then, like, since I'm petite, but a little bit, you know, thick in the bottom, it does fry it as up in the back so I can wear some bike shorts if I want to or wear it by itself 
And this is what it looks like. Yeah. Alright, and then keeping with the tie-dye theme, we have this cute little tie-dye shirt. And I paired it with these shorts I got from them as well. I just wanted some, like, cute, like, shorts that they're good on me. I believe they're size 6 or 8. And this is what they look like. Um, I love it because it's like the length, it hides, it, you know, not too short on the back. <laughs> and yeah, I like this shirt because then I could just wear it like this or just wear it with some bike shorts. <laughs> Which I've been loving bike shorts. They are the most amazing thing ever. Okay, then the next item we have are these light wash jean shorts. And with this Alice What in Wonderland tee. Um, I know it's black and we're in a heat, basically a heat wave in Texas. But yes, I love Disney so I might as well get a Disney shirt. And yeah, this is what it looks like. And yes, the shorts do cover the booty. And okay, and now this item is a jean like utility or whatever it has got. Basically like a romper with a zipper. And I got this because honestly it reminds me of Ally and the uh, Fifth Harmony work from home video. <laughs> so yeah, she can put it right here. Oh no, it's down here, but you know, we're not gonna have the girls out. Um <laughs> yeah, I like it because again it fits like I also like if it it's a like, good length, like it's not too short. And everything and what it looks like plus I think this was petite or regular I think petite so it hits me like right at my waist which is nice because well sometimes like on um, when I get regular people clothes as I call it the waist is like down here the waist ends up like right here on me and I'm like that and yeah this would be like PJ set but the shorts the shorts are tight they feel tight around the thighs and stuff like that and they uh, make my butt look like a pancake look at this uh, yeah I when I saw like I forgot about them but when I saw them because I got this in a medium and because I thought it was just gonna be sure it was only like I took it like small large medium but I think they were medium I think but I got this and I saw the shorts. They look like shorts that probably a little kid would wear. And so, yeah. Yeah, they're really under last thread on the thighs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and plus, like, seeing the color, it's like grayish. But I feel like. I feel like I belong in, um. And I think it's either the Hunger Games or Divergent where they wear gray. And yeah. Yep. And the shorts again maybe you look like you like looks like Chicha. Yeah, good thing. I mean <laughs> good thing the shorts are just for home, right? Right? Now of these, like, I shouldn't have to explain, like, y'all know I love Harry Styles, but this is very watermelon because of watermelon sugar. Hi! Watermelon sugar! Hi! Uh, yeah, so I got these, I think these are in a size large, and yes. Yeah! And again, these are some PJs, I'll leave down below. Item is this oversized sweater, or it was oversized, but then they put on dry. It says Columbia because you know, my dream school. Why not get a <laughs> Why not get a sweater? Uh, yeah. So this is it. I always love to wear sweaters. Plus, you know, sometime in Texas it's gonna turn into fall, so I might as well start getting my sweaters or jumpers. 
But I'm still waiting for it in the mail, so that's why I made this video because of this whole thing, it will be out. Oh, get it? But yes, I will film that for next video, so super excited about that. Um, yeah, let me know what video next y'all want to see. Um, again, like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me down on, on my social medias. Um, I will also be having like a blog. A vlog post out maybe this week. We'll see. I know it's been a while. <laughs> but yeah, so I'll link down my blog as well down below. Um, remember to stay safe. Remember to wear your mask. Remember to stay six feet away from people. Um, just remember to look to still support your momo. Remember to support your still local mom and pop shops. Uh, what else? Remember to stay so stay healthy and as I'm filming this, uh, rest in peace Chad Bozeman. Uh, thank you for giving, thank you for blessing us with all your amazing performances. And so since I told him that, you know, so you guys, Wakanda forever. Bye. Adios. I love you. Mwah.